everyone, welcome back. Today we are in The Sims 4 again doing another cast video, but today I am just um, going to go through and make tank top, look, tank top looks video. Um, so basically I am just going in and whatever The Sims 4 casts, classes as a, I can't speak today, classes as this tank top I am using. So first up we have this pink look. Um, pink paint tank top pink jeans pink shoes bit of the top but it's fine um but uh, some of these tank tops i didn't actually agree with like i was looking i was like does that count as a tank top like i wouldn't have counted it but because the sims 4 says it is i'm trying to do a vast majority of tank like i'm trying to do a like show all of them in this video not all of the tank tops in the sims because there's a lot um just like showing different versions of outfit i don't really know but just ignore me basically um but yeah t but this first look oh yeah it's obviously very pink um pink nails pink bracelets all that fun stuff um but yeah that is basically the first look done um next up for number two we have obviously got a second tank top i went for this crop one um start off was picking a gray swatch but then didn't love it with some of the pants I was choosing and then I, I was kind of found these jeans from high school years so I thought it would work um, and they were like low rise these ones right here and I couldn't really they just watched so it wasn't working with it so I ended up going for this like white top and paired it with some white shoes um, very 2000s yes Y2K I guess um, I guess because it's just like low rise jeans is what's giving that opinion I guess from me from me um but yeah we've got um very standard makeup um and um standard jewelry as well I was thinking about doing a necklace but nothing really worked so I ended up just going necklace free in the end anyway because I was thinking about doing this like, um choker but then the choker just kind of like fit weird like it did not fit weird but like it just didn't work with like the neckline of the top I guess so yeah and then just went for some hair I started a little bit looking trying to find out right here for this then I found this one was a headband it kind of gave me the Y2K vibes as well which went with the look so I thought like yeah let's just do that Moving on to the third look, um, I went for this, um, um, I've, I, I started off with a, the beige swatch of this um, tank top and then couldn't really find an outfit that worked with it enough for me because I wanted to do a skirt and then I found this skirt that had like checkered pattern I was like oh that would be really cute but then obviously it didn't work with the beige so I ended up going for changing it to a black um, swatch of the top because um, I was like yep yeah, that kind of worked I did spend a while trying to find the right pants um, for this as you can see ended up going back to this swatch I did think about doing pink but then the pinks didn't match I was just like yeah but with this look it kind of looks like what Disney would dress their characters in, Disney Channel would dress their characters in on shows back in the day um, was kind of, I, and the reason, the reason I got that vibe is just literally just because I added gloves if I didn't add gloves it probably wouldn't have given that vibe but then I added a full brim hat and I was like you know what it, it, I'm going all the way with this full brim hat with the gloves like it's, this is a very over the top look but who cares you know it's the sims um <laughs> And yeah, just some standard makeup as well. As well, very dark makeup to go with the look, obviously. And yeah, that is the next look done. Also, kind of gets witch vibes, maybe. But anyway, um, moving on, we have this. I would not call this a tank top. I would call this a bralette or a crop, like a crop top. But it's under tank top, so that is what I I am using it as. And I went for a kind of like cream color of this look um, and um, yeah basically that was yeah went for a cream color we paired it with some white shoes um, and white accessories um, I don't really know why I went white because I went for a cream outfit and I kind of like looking at it now I'm like oh that doesn't really match you know what I mean like it's 
I don't know. Anyway, I was thinking also about doing a hat, but then kind of gave up on that because I couldn't find the right colour scheme for that either. Um, and just went for some dark makeup, some basic accessories. Um, yeah, nothing too exciting about that. Um, so, yeah, that is about it though for this look. Um, moving on to number five of eight. Um, we have obviously got the next crop top. Um, which again, I would have called this a cami, not a tank top, um, but you know, I don't make the rules. So yeah, and I paired it with um, some shorts. I ended up going for a purple outfit for this one because I found these black shorts with like a purple bow and I thought, you know what, let me just change the top to purple. And then went for some black um, wedges and then added more purple in with the accessories, I guess. So like the purple nails, purple bracelet, um, and then did wear a, um, did I go for the black, a black hat for this one? Um, and I, I guess I did just skip over it, just ignore that. I basically spent way too long trying to find the hair for this, um, and I thought that was boring, so I skipped over that anyway. Um, but yeah, I just went for this black hat, um, don't know why, um, yeah. I would say I don't, yeah. Anyway, that is that look done. Very basic, that one. Very summery, I guess. Um, I guess tank tops are very summery. Next up, I went for this, like, grunge look. Basically, I just used everything from the grunge kit. Um, because I ended up finding the pants to go with this top. Um, and I ended up going purple. Actually, very purple for this look. Um, purple top, purple jeans. Um, and then just some sneakers, um, I think I just went for white sneakers just to also match with the white belt, um, in the end, um, I guess to bring in, and also this white on the top, so it just made sense, um, some purple nail polish, um, and got rid of her bath hat that was on her head because it doesn't really go with the vibe, um, and went for some purple makeup as well to incorporate that in more um and yeah just some basic accessories and yeah that is the grunge tank top look done next up we are on our second to last look now um i went for this um i guess it's like a bandana top um tank top and went for a very summery kind of look um this one quite quickly actually very simple all black um with some ripped jeans some black accessories um and went for some hair from i think it's marriage stories is that the pack name i can't remember it's been so long now since it came out um and yeah just some dark makeup and stuff like that so yeah that is basically that look done just adding the final accessories and yeah on to our last look um again very simple very um i wanted to go for like 70s and i went for like a pink and red very clashy look for this last one um yeah but that is about it really so yeah i'm gonna wrap it up here thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed this video uh let me know and i'll see you guys again soon with another one